Oh man. I think we got a decent fish too, guys. He's just chilling here. All right, guys, we're gonna put some uh, big old baits out. Anchored here in uh, on the back side of an island. Um, not the front, but the back where it kind of shallows out and then there's a channel on each side of me. The left side is a, is a shallower channel and the right side is the main channel. So I'm right in between both and I'll be able to get baits all around. So a um, little bit deeper water, uh, four to seven. And uh, let's see if that, see if that makes a difference you know I don't, I don't know but uh my theory is they're coming off the spawn pretty uh pretty soon here and uh that should um this should be where they kind of recuperate i hope nobody knows but we'll find out Got a couple raindrops coming down. I mean, conditions are really good. So, you never know, man. Just gotta throw some baits and move around a little bit. And I uh, hope that we luck into a big one. That is my goal tonight, a big old flathead. Be even cooler if it came on this ugly stick. Got some bigger, bigger bluegills tonight. It's been raining literally all day long, so we have current. I don't know, you just never know. Let's uh, get the rest of these baits out here and it's 8 o'clock now, it gets dark in an hour. We'll stay about 30 minutes past dark at this spot. See if we can pick a few off. Then we'll move. You can see kind of where the main channel is out there. We got a few bullheads, we got to throw some of them out. See where the main channel is right there with the current. Put those by the lily pads over there. Right, yep, I like when the water's rising. I mean, it hasn't rained for a while, and today it rained for like seven hours, so. It should uh, help, help the cause, guys. Bullhead. He's seen better days, hasn't he? He's just gonna go back. Not looking so hot. Ooh, what's that? We got a sucker? Let's throw a sucker out there. Nice soft bait. That one's right on the ledge. That's about seven foot over there.
give them a little variety guys all right we're set the traps are locked and loaded let's see if we can get a big flathead tonight This is a channel cat, guys. He deserves this. He's jumping. It's not a channel cat. That's a flathead, guys. Did you see that takedown? Oh my God. Wow. That was a good takedown, guys. And that's an okay flathead. Oh. Man, you smoked it, buddy. Guys, that flathead, I don't know if you'll be able to see it because I didn't have the light on. But that was one of the hardest hitting little flatheads I've had in a while. Man, he's a good looking one too. Look at that. No spawn marks, no nothing. Really fat fish. Wow, what a hit. He deserves a picture, guys. Look at that. He gets his he gets his uh two seconds of fame. <laughs> One more look. Going back. We're gonna sit here a little bit longer. I'm not sure what I caught that on now. I almost want to say it was a bluegill or a bullhead. I think it was a bullhead. He smoked it. All right, there's a little bullhead going back out there. Going search and destroy mission. All right, let's go. We're gonna wait on him, guys. Got him that time. Why is he going that way? That's a good one. Here's a good flathead, guys. That's a really good fish, guys. Yes. That is a good one. I gotta get the net. This one's already tired. Come here, baby. Got him. 
That's the one I was looking for, guys. Yep. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Yeah, boys. Yeah, guys. Man, look at the marks and rashes on him. Tail's a little messed up. That's a good one, though. He came back. I mean, I missed that fish. I'm going to show you right here real quick. Collar off the rod. So instead of choosing. But, uh... He came back. That was awesome. Man, he's so angry. And that's a good fish. One more look at him. Definitely like 20 something. Not a 30, but he's gonna. Definitely a healthy one. Here he goes, back, back in the water. That was on a live bluegill. I'm gonna let you go, bud. Ow! There he goes. He cut me up. All right, let's get another bait back out real quick. Ah. Uh. We'd be crazy not, not to, right? Put a dinner plate out there. All right. All right, there he is, going back out. All right, we're set. Got one going up river, guys. We got one. We got a decent fish too, guys. He's just chilling here. Oh my God. I think we got a good one. Yep. He's still on the bottom. Feels like a good fish. It's really hard to tell. Ugly stick, boys. He's gonna...
can't see him yet. Oh, he's a giant. Look at these spawned up nasty guys. Let's see if we can get them in the boat. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a good one, guys. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Man, that's a good fish. show you this one he is uh man this is the most beat up fish i probably ever caught he's just angry this one's another about 20 pounder and look at that rash on him here we go just rough guys <laughs> that's a good one though that's a really fun fight All right, we're gonna let this one go, guys. Man, look at that nasty, nasty spawn mark on his bottom, too. He's been getting bit right there. That's a bite mark right there, look at that. Here's another question for you guys. Do you think that's a flathead biting him? Because I do. This is probably a female. goes all right guys we are out of here but we finally figured out a little bit of a pattern um, I'm finding flatheads in a little bit deeper water looks like they're coming off the spawn and that's kind of where they're hanging out so um, I'm gonna try to stay on these fish before they uh, switch it up again on me but I'm assuming that they're gonna start going into the brush piles and the wood and holding tight to structure like a summer pattern so for now i'm going to try to keep uh keep on them and hope you enjoyed the video and hit that like hit that subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video